the vast tapestry of Hindu literature, the moon deity Chandra emerges as a radiant and significant figure casting his ethereal light upon the world. Chandra, often depicted as a handsome figure riding a celestial chariot drawn by ten white horses, personifies the moon in Hindu literature. Chandra's tale is woven with the threads of a cosmic drama involving Daksha, a revered sage and a creator of the universe. Among his many offspring were the 27 daughters known as Nakshatras, each representing a lunar mansion. Within the celestial clan, Chandra's heart glowed particularly for his wife Rohini, sparking a jealousy among his other wives. The wives, resentful of Chandra's favoritism, took their grievances to their father Daksha, igniting a chain of events that would forever change the lunar deity's destiny. Daksha's curse cast a shadow over Chandra, causing his brightness to fade, plunging the world into darkness. Seeking redemption, Chandra turned to Lord Shiva, the compassionate deity reowned for his wisdom and empathy. Impressed by Chandra's devotion, Shiva bestowed upon him a boon. Chandra's light was restored, but his luminescence would now wax and wane with the lunar cycle. This waxing and waning of Chandra became the lunar phases that we observe today. Chandra's journey carries an invaluable lesson, a reminder of the consequences of pride and the virtues of humility. Today, Chandra continues to grace the night sky, guiding us through the cycles of life with his changing faces. The story of Chandra resonates as a celestial reminder, teaching us that seeking guidance during challenging times and recognizing our own strengths and weaknesses can illuminate our path. And as Chandra's light shines on, his story reminds us of the profound connection between the cosmos and our own lives. To watch more such interesting videos, please like, share and subscribe and do not forget to press the bell icon for notifications. Thank you.